Well, what's up again there guys, Brian here, the 3 Topics Gamer, and I just got done watching EA's live play announcement, so live stream, and um, after several weeks of anticipation and tons of rumors, they, can, they pretty much have confirmed, without a shadow of doubt, that in fact, Dead Space is in fact coming back, and from the little teaser that they showed us, it is in fact going to be a direct remake of the very first game, which I'm pumped up for. Dead Space is my all-time favorite survival horror franchise of all time, so to see it come back, I am very, very excited. Now, we didn't get to see too much of it. Um, they did show us a little bit of like a visual demonstration of what this game would generally look like using the frostbit engine and i have to say just from the little snippets that we saw we saw a little bit of the ship that we were going to be visiting we saw a little bit of the necromorphs that we we're probably going to be fighting and we i'm pretty sure we did see the backside of isaac so again i'm really pumped up for this and <laughs> oh this is this is going to be amazing this this just easily has the uh potential of being my most anticipated game of next year. They didn't tell us when this game was coming out, but my hope is it'll probably, hopefully it'll be coming out sometime next year. And they did pretty much confirm that it is only coming out on current gen consoles, so it won't be coming back on the PlayStation 4, or the Xbox One, or any of the last gen systems, which is perfectly fine. We definitely need to start moving forward into focusing on the current gen consoles, so I'm happy with that. Now that we know that this is going to be a remake to the first Dead Space game, I just want to do this uh, quick little video just going over uh, a few things that I want to see in this remake. Now before I get into my few little suggestions or just wants that I want from this remake, if you do happen to enjoy this video by the end, I would really appreciate if you give this video a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to keep track of me on all my future videos because I will be talking more about this as we get more information hopefully over the next couple of days. So, uh, number one, the first thing that I want added to the Dead Space remake is for one, Give Isaac Clark a voice. Now, Isaac didn't really talk very much in the first game. In fact, what I really liked about how they told the story in the first Dead Space game was very, very unique. Um, was that you pretty much would just kind of go around and you let the other characters that were with Isaac when he first crashed on the USS Ishimura pretty much do a lot of the talking for him. And you also got to kind of have to read a bunch of journal logs as long as listen to a bunch of audio logs and that pretty much gave you an idea of exactly what had happened on the Ishimura just before you got there. Now this was a very very creative way of telling its story but I think that by not having Isaac have a voice he didn't really feel too much as a character. He didn't really react all that much especially since he was trying to find his girlfriend Nicole so I did find it a little bit strange how he wouldn't say a word. You got to see his face, but he didn't talk much. But he did talk in the sequel of Dead Space 2, and I think that to me was the key element that allowed it to elevate over the first game, because Isaac did then feel like a full realized character who actually had to go through certain trials and certain events and react to certain things that were happening to him, and I think that can only be achieved if you give Isaac Clark a voice. That way he feels like a fully realized character. If they do that, then I think this remake is going to go a long way to actually elevating itself over the first game, or the original game. The next thing I want want to see is something that's fairly small and that's the introduction of new necromorphs now i'm pretty sure we're going to see a lot of the old classics that were in the first game probably just in frostbit engine they're probably going to look horrifying they're going to look in incredibly scary i mean I, I would say they they can still look scary in the original game but um i would definitely like to see new designs just just see how the infection or the infection can affect different people uh a suggestion I have is, you know, I'm sure that, you know, some of the uh, colonists or the travelers on the uh, USS Ishimura would have had pets, like maybe dogs or cats or birds or, or something. What if we could see necromorph animals? Um, that I believe that was a, an idea that they did kind of experiment a little bit in Dead Space 3, but I would like to see just different forms of necromorphs in this first in the in the remake i think that's something that's probably fair that we can hopefully get to see and i believe the third thing that i would like to see in a remake is a different path now i'm now they pretty much didn't necessarily confirm it but just from the little teaser i could tell that we are going back to the uss issue more so the primary story is probably going to play out the same in terms of you're playing as isaac clark who's going to go to the uss issue more things go with the hell very quickly and you have to fight your way through in order to survive but i do not want to see a just scene for scene copy from the first game now 
they I'm guessing they're kind of following the same model as like what Capcom did with say you know the Resident Evil 2 remake and the Resident Evil 3 remake in terms of taking key scenes and just you know making doing them slightly different but I would really appreciate if for this version of Dead Space uh, just do it differently you can still have a number of the like, key environments or key scenes that are taken from the first game but I really would like to see this game do the story in a different way that way it can have its own identity because i think the one downside of having these remakes is that you know as a remake you you definitely want to copy what the first game did but i think it's important that a remake does enough on its own that it allows it to stand apart instead of just just being a beat for beat rip off of the first game as much i mean trust me that would work i mean heck i, I think no one would complain especially I me mean, no one would complain if they just took this game and just made a just beat for beat mechanics just copy and paste just upgrade the visuals with the new with the with the to the frostbite engine and just have it be that if they did that i would be happy with that perfectly but i think that allowing to tell the story in a different way even if you still come to the same conclusion would do a lot of good and it would probably even enhance my anticipation for this game even more because uh, as it stands right now if they give us a like a release date for next year this game will automatically probably be into into being my most anticipated game of next year for sure but again i would like to see them tell the story that was told in this game just done differently even again if you come to the same conclusion and that's pretty much all just just an initial video just giving my thoughts on what little we saw from the uh, teaser for the upcoming dead space game so now that you guys have heard just my suggestions if you guys did happen to have a chance to actually see this teaser or had a chance to play the original dead space when it came out what are some things that you would like to see in this remake share your thoughts with me and everyone else in the comments down below and like always thank you guys for watching you're awesome and i will see you next time